Actor Robert De Niro railed against White House Press Secretary Sarah Huckabee Sanders, saying that the bullies and liars in President Trump's administration deserve the vile jokes comedian Michael Wolf, Michelle Wolf, I'm sorry, heard at them on Sunday during the White House Correspondents Association's dinner. There was a lot of truth on Michelle Wolf's jokes, and the bullies and the liars are still intimidated by the strength and the truth. Where we run into trouble is when we allow the bullies and liars to dictate the conversation. De Niro told the audience on Monday at the Film Society of Lincoln Center's annual Chaplin Award Gala in New York. The taxi driver star shamed uh, the White House Correspondents Association after its president Margaret Tel Aviv. Tel Aviv, I'm sorry. Oh my God, Tel Aviv! Did I just say that? Wolf's performance in which she viciously mocked Sanders looks into a told series of obscene jokes. Shame on that, De Niro said of the White House Correspondents' Dinner Association. Stand up and strap up on your balls and deal. It was the only time I've ever had a sympathy or empathy for Sarah Sanders. They cut to her and all of a sudden she looked like she was hurt. I said, geez, maybe she's a real human being? I thought she's got two or three kids. What she is doing to tell her kids in 10 years about how she represented or protected Donald Trump? The actor asked. How is that going to come true? I don't know. How could she justify, rationalize uh, her behavior? What does it take to just walk away from that situation? De Niro, of course, has a long derided President Trump. Last month, the 74-year-old said, America is being run by a madman who would recognize the truth if it came inside the bucket of his beloved Colonel Sanders fried chicken. This is more funny than Michelle Wolfe.